we present a new framework for computing the media access transform MAT of 3D shapes while preserving their media features by restricted power diagram RPD. The media axis is a fundamental geometric structure and has been widely used in approximating, simplifying, and analyzing shapes. We have observed that media features play an important role in guaranteeing many topological and geometric properties of media axis. External features, such as sharp edges and corners of the input, represent the non smoothness of the surface. Internal features, on the other hand, define the inner topological structure of seams and junctions so that media axis has a natural decomposition into multiple manifold sheets. However, all existing methods fail to preserve external features. Internal features are even more difficult to capture since they are hidden information of the input shape. Existing solutions tend to increase surface sampling rate or decrease voxel size globally in order to maintain the internal features. In this paper, we present the first framework for computing approximated MAT that preserves both external and internal media features while ensuring the approximation accuracy. Our pipeline consists of four major stages. Given a closed manifold mesh with sharp feature predetected, the first stage is to initialize the media spheres. After placing surface samples, the sphere candidates on non feature regions are inner Borona balls generated with the long triangulation of surface samples. For external feature regions, we initialize zero radius media spheres on those predetected sharp edges and corners. This sampling will further be refined using our feature preservation strategy in following stages. In the second stage, we update those inner sphere candidates as close as possible to their ground truth position and radii using our sphere updating strategy. In this paper, we formulate the updating algorithm for spheres with any number of tangent points as a continuous optimization problem. We also show the RPD and its corresponding media mesh structure before and after the update. In the third stage, we construct an initial media mesh from this updated media sphere candidates using the restricted regular triangulation, RRT, which is a door to RPD. For preserving external corner features, we select a small region from the given corner and propose a corner preservation strategy to approximate the media mesh structure in the small region around the corner. For preserving external edge features, our adaptive resampling strategy will detect the deficiency of feature spheres on external edge features, then recursively adding new feature spheres until all external edge features are preserved. We show external features on the generated media mesh in black. The internal features are traced using same tracing algorithm. In the fourth stage, the initial media mesh is further refined. To refine the internal features, we first detect this ill post connections under the help of their RPCs. Then, we sample new internal feature spheres using the tangential surface contact points aggregated from two ill-connected spheres.
up to now, the refined media mesh still contains some flat but solid tetrahedrons. We propose a geometry-guided Dini algorithm to rank all triangles of any tetrahedron in the media mesh using their importance factors. Then we remove simple pairs with least importance in each iteration until all tetrahedrons are pruned. Here we show some comparisons with existing methods. For more comparisons, please refer to the original paper. To our best knowledge, CAD media is the only method that works on preserving external features of the media axis so far. However, their sampling condition near sharp edges is extremely strict and very hard to be achieved if the sharp edge is not a straight line. We compare our generated media mesh with three other famous methods. PC cannot preserve any media features, and the generated media mesh is not thin with large number of flat tetrahedrons. ICT cannot preserve external features. It also favors a dense representation with large number of media spheres in order to preserve internal features. The media mesh generated from VC shrinks. It also produces zigzag structure around the external feature curves for models whose boundary curves are not parallel to the voxel boundaries. Please refer to the paper for more comparisons analysis with VC. We also compare the reconstruction ability of our method with the existing methods. We show five example results of our generated media mesh of various corners. The first three models contain saddles incident to both convex and concave lines on input shape. The fourth model is a wedge with small angles. The fifth model is a discretized cone with corner on the tip. We also give an analysis of our geometry-guided Dini algorithm. The plan thinning algorithm prunes tetrahedrons by removing simple pairs randomly. We found this operation routinely produce open pockets even though the topology is correct. This is because the random choice of simple pairs does not consider geometry information as some faces are more important than others in a single tetrahedron. Our geometry-aware thinning algorithm produces geometrically accurate media meshes.
Here we show some more examples of our generated media mesh together with their media features. Thank you for watching.